So, welcome back to my channel, baby. Been a minute. I'm trying to, I've been trying to get my life together, basically. I'm trying, trying to get the, get the pieces going. Been going through the slump online. Been struggling for a hot minute. And everything just keeps, bah, another one, bah, another one, bah, bah, bah. Just like one thing after the other, after the other, after the other. <sighs> Sorry. I'm working out on a bike. I'll talk about that in a little bit. But it's just one thing after the other. So, I just felt like, man, bro, nothing's going right. Nothing's going to go. Nothing's working out. It's just, everything's falling apart. I don't know what to do. I don't, I don't know what I've been doing that's making this dude go like that. I don't know. It's just, it's been a lot. So, I finally came into the re uh, realization that I need to get myself out of my head and start doing what I want to do to get to where I want to be. Though, I still have a long ways ahead of me to get there. I'm just, you gotta keep trucking through, gotta keep trucking, bah, bah, bah. gotta keep trucking. If you stop trucking, you want to stay at that rest stop for too long and you can't be doing that man i'm still young but at the same time i've i've already experienced how to live on my own and how to basically fend for myself completely so when i came home it was i was making enough to like pay get my own apartment here get bills and still maintain my dog and my car that's how much money I was making when I first got back to Miami. I was making enough to pay all of that and still go out. So mind you, y'all know Miami's super expensive. So the fact that I was able to, like I already did the math and I found some places that I could have stayed and all that. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm gonna work out back. Uh, the amount of time it took me to do that math and stuff, it took me a little bit, I'm not great at math. Uh, I decided, you know what? Nah, I'm not gonna waste my money on an apartment and all that stuff. I'm gonna stay here living with grandma and just do what I gotta do, you know? So I was like, I was getting ahead of my payments, all that stuff. And then all of a sudden, I decided, I decided this is all me. Let me stay home. I wanna stay and take care of my grandmother a little bit more than what I've been doing. I feel like. I wasn't doing enough because that was the main reason why I moved home. <laughs> Take care of my abuela. Because, hey man, everybody has a life. I'm still young. I, I have time to grow. So I was like, yeah, I, I can take care of no problem. <sighs> Bro, when I tell you I quit that job, making that much money to making nothing, I had to use my savings because <sighs> my car payment. They won't let me pay a head on it for some reason. Haven't figured that out. I'm gonna try to get around that. I don't know why they don't do that. Then, you know what? It's just, it's stuff I gotta pay and I ended up running out of money within like three, four months. So then I had to get that job back again. But they weren't offering as many hours. Since I left, I was originally the full time and then I left so the other person took over so I had to get less hours. I was still making enough to pay my bills, but I, I guess all the free time started making me get laid back and just want to stay at home and not want to do anything and all that. Bro. Messed up. I was 155. I was actually, I was getting toned. I was doing what I've been wanting to do. But then started letting myself go again, bro. So I went from 155 and right now I'm going to admit it. I'm 171.8 pounds. So basically 172. Your girl's been going through it. And let me tell you, man, it's, it's not fun. It's not fun to be in the freaking slump every couple months. I need to start working on myself more. I need to start taking care of myself. I need to start not letting myself get so down on, on myself either. So... I just realized what song was playing and I originally had down with the sickness playing so 
yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Been on this bank for a hot minute. I'm already out of breath. But I'm still going. So, we got this baby. We got this. I feel it in my abs already. That sucks. But it's alright. We're gonna do good. <clears throat> Anyways. Another reason why I'm on the bike. I gained 15 pounds. Yeah, 15. Yeah, 15 pounds, basically. And I want to lose it. I want to... I want to make myself look good again because I, I look at myself in the mirror now and I, I'm like grossed out. I'm like, bro, what do I look like this? I really let myself go. I really just said, you know what? Let the world take me as it is. Nothing's going to happen. <sighs> I sure as hell thought wrong. That world said, all right, bet I'm going to come crashing down on you real quick. Bloop. It got me. But I'm fighting back, taking it off of me little by little. Bah, 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 bah. Mm. Fast season. For my girls. Just around the corner, baby. Just around the corner. Let's go. I see so much potential in these girls, man. They just got to put in the work. No complaining. Just doing. Just grind, baby. Just grind. There's another. That's actually another reason why I'm losing weight, too. I... For practice, like, I play with them. I play with y'all. But, man, I'm so out of shape. It's horrible. I want to keep up. I don't want you guys to make fun of me because I'm out of shape. I shouldn't be out of shape if I'm your coach trying to show you what you got to do. So, I want you guys, if you guys are watching this, I want you guys to keep me accountable. My track team as well, if you guys see this, keep me accountable. Tell me to stay on my stuff. All right? If you see that I'm starting to... Slack off and be like, nah, 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 get your head straight. And, All right, I'll listen to you. I'll listen to you. Remind me, remind me of this moment right now that I said to remind me to get out of my head and keep going. <sighs> I promise you, by the end of the year, your girl's gonna look fantastic. <sighs> no more belly, more muscles. <clears throat> Like, not gonna lie, my, my arms stay pretty toned. Like, look at that tricep. I didn't have that before. I've been doing something right. But, we got this, baby. We got this. I'm so tired. But for some reason, I guess because of a fan right above my head, I haven't been, like, dripping sweat. Like, I'm sweaty, but not, not bad. So, it's a little weird. Because usually after, like, my first 10, 15 minutes of working out, I'll be drenched in sweat. Even ask my whole teammates. Even ask my high school teammates. First 10 minutes, I was already getting sweaty. I you saw the sweat coming down my face. It was bad, bro. <sighs> my sisters called me sweaty girl when I was little. Honestly, I don't know why I said that. I might cut that out. Nah, you know what? No, no, no. We'll keep it in the video. We'll keep it in here. A little something about me. There you go. Y'all better not make fun of me about it. You mention it, I swear. You're not gonna like my response. Just kidding, I'll probably tell you not to like mention that again, but that's it. So, I hope everybody has had a beautiful Monday. I am still going through the day, it's only morning, but we still got the rest of the day. <clears throat> oh my gosh. You guys, I'm like really out of shape. It's horrible. Anyways, I hope you guys have a beautiful rest of your Monday. If if you're having a bad day, think of something that makes you have a good day and then just start adding little things after that. Man, man, I love this person. They love when I do this. Maybe I could hit them up today. If you're in school, if you're a student still, even in college, like, all right, what's my schedule today? Let's see what time I got to like maybe sit by myself, do some meditation. I've been, I started that yesterday. Not gonna lie, when, after I was done with meditating, I felt fantastic, bro. I felt like I could do anything for the rest of the day. Weird, bro. Weird. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, yeah. Just fight for yourself. Want to do better. Be great. Because even if you don't think you have anybody behind you, you got yourself. And even with people that you got behind your back that are there just to help you and support you when you need it, 
You need to be there for yourself first and foremost. People don't understand that. You can't take care of yourself. You're not going to be able to take care of anybody else. It just takes a mental toll on you. You just... It's just tough. And it's hard to put on a, a face and make it seem like everything's all right. So... I'm tired of being tired, baby. It's a short video today, guys. But have a great day. I'm really tired. And I still got a whole bunch of other workouts I got to do. So, bye, guys.